Why do thousands of tons of steel float on water, but a small stone sinks immediately? Let's unravel this maritime mystery. Picture this. You're at the lake, skipping stones. Small, heavy. They zip across the water, then sink. Now, imagine a giant cruise ship. Despite being made of tons of metal, it floats. What's the secret? It's all about density and displacement, thanks to our friend, Archimedes. Archimedes' principle states that an object submerged in fluid is buoyed up by a force equal to the weight of the fluid displaced. In simpler terms, if a ship can push away water that weighs as much as it does, it'll float. Think of it like sitting in a bathtub. When you get in, water spills over the edge, right? You've displaced water equal to your weight. Ships do the same, but on a much grander scale. They are designed hollow, spreading their weight over a huge area, displacing enough water to keep them afloat. So next time you see a ship, remember, it's not just a vessel, it's a masterclass in physics. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel.